Hello everyone, Bubba the Vulture back once again for a little bit more Let's Play Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Um, yeah, so, Sagram, right? I <laughs> know. So boss. It is so choice. If you have the means, I highly recommend it. Anyways. Let's get back to things here. This portion of the castle seems to be largely emptied out. What about over here? More of your standard array of Nova skeletons and flippin... Jacko bones. that if you used um, life max life max hey there ghosty it was life max um, but if you use the uh, used the bat uh, sonar power Cheers. And I'm puzzled. Also, apparently, uh, I would have had a lot easier time fighting Beelzebub. I had an item, which I'm not sure if I had it at the time. I know I have it now. That protects you from poison actually heals you instead uh, of when you are hit by poison. Like, poison damage causes healing. There's a number of that sort of thing in this game, isn't there? Instead of being protected against the thing, the thing turns into life for you. Yeah, just go for it, Ghosty. Who cares if I get poisoned? I mean, really, who does? Yeah, take that, Balloon Pod. I have learned how to deal with you efficiently. <clears throat> what? Well done. As a matter of pride, I want to take out all those little uh, balloon pod pods. You 
don't forget you, buddy. Bet there's a save point over here. Yes, yeah, save point. And there's not that much, if I remember right, to be explored down back here, so maybe I'll just do that a little bit. This one is the Doppelganger of Forte. Stone abilities, so that's not cool. Ha <laughs> ha! You don't have a vortex to be sucked into. Motherfucker! Ah, I managed to just be turning while the life max stop took place. Your yeah, life max. Well, there you go. Doppelganger, uh, 40. Like, Thunderkiss, uh, 65, or whatever. <laughs> they say you can drown yourself in two inches of water. Apparently that is not true for Alucard. Um, hi, guys. Dark Metamorphosis go. We don't need it. There's so many Dark Dopuses here. Time to do so. You guys are weird, man. I mean, just weird. It's the dog boy. What's up with the dog boy? The dog boy. Sold forged by elves. This is Alzul Fazlani. It's gonna take too long. actually turn out to be very efficient. And prevented me from having to, uh, you know, spend a whole lot of time, like, hitting them and saying, what the hell? And having a look at them as much. 
I mean, really, guys, what the hell? And when we have that question answered, we'll be a lot farther along in our understanding of what the hell. Meanwhile, wee oof. We all remember in the right side up castle, this was the place where you could find succubus and some kind of bizarre false. Uh, I mean, I guess it was still a, uh, was a some kind of weird ass glowing uh, hearts max, hearts max. Hearts max, hearts max, hearts max. No, but it's some kind of weird, um, sarcophagus that, uh, gave, uh, Alucard nightmares when he slept in it. It was like Starzoo. I mean, basically, you know, it was there, and he, uh, got nightmares, and then he couldn't stand the nightmares anymore, so he went to the base. And that's how the game began. Pretty sure. Yeah, we got a meal ticket. A meal ticket. Meal ticket and a meal ticket. Thinking over here is going to be a meal ticket. Delicious. So you know what? I'm going to come in here and I'm going to overwrite the data and I'm going to stop right there. This is potentially kind of a short one, but uh, I don't remember what's over there, but considering what it was in the other castle, it might be something significant. Who wants there to be something sick? Nah, you know what? Looking at the clock now, it's only 13 flippin' minutes. I would be cheating you. I would be cheating you out of entertainment. I'm not gonna stop, folks. I'm gonna turn into a dog. Mist. And a bat. And back into me. I don't have a good way to check in on my timer. I just sort of have to look at a clock and say, When did I start? Oh, yeah. And after all that... Peanuts! Peanuts! Don't they know Alucard's allergic? Peanuts are... almost... certainly just a food item. They're difficult to eat. I didn't realize that they were difficult to eat. I've never had that much trouble eating peanuts. I mean, pistachios, I guess, can occasionally be... Difficult or sunflower seeds. I guess I could see them being described as difficult. I wouldn't necessarily, but I could see it. You Jago bones. Explored all the way down, all the way over. We are soon going to meet back up with where we were with respect to Sorry, uh 
Utmost concentration there, you understand. Tiger mushrooms. You know, I'm a bit more leveled up than I used to be, too. That does also help in taking out these blue Venus weeds. Blue Venus weeds. Alright, so I've done exploring up there. Well, that was a loss of a goodly portion of my life. I think I shall now retire back to save room over here. You know, the save room. Since after all, we did discover that there were peanuts there and that's all that was there. Peanuts to you. question is, where do we go from here? Which is the way that's clear? Still looking for that blue jean baby queen. Prettiest girl i ever seen. Etc, etc. There's not a good, um... There's not a good warp point anywhere nearby here. There's no warp zones. Um, if I fell back down, uh, I could uh, explore the sort of Grand Hall area again, which I hadn't gotten around to. Of course, uh, the whole clock tower, all rocks, its chambers, all that stuff is still left to be checked out. The Colosseum. Maybe something cool is going on in the Colosseum. Maybe, maybe not. Uh -uh. Maybe you guys can tell me. Maybe you can't. Either way, though, folks, this is Boba the Vulture. This is Let's Play Castlevania Symphony of the Night. When we come back next time, more exploring. See you guys then. Bye now.